Tackling Tricky Fragments, Mastering English Sentence Structure. Hello learners. Welcome back to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to dive deep into the world of sentences, specifically focusing on a common error, sentence fragments. Are you ready? Let's explore this together. In English, a complete sentence needs at least a subject and a verb, and it must express a complete thought. Sentence fragments, on the other hand, are incomplete sentences. They might be missing a subject, a verb, or don't form a complete idea. For instance, walking down the street. This is a fragment because it has no subject. The first step to avoiding sentence fragments is being able to identify them. Here are some common types of sentence fragments. 1. Missing subject fragments. These lack a subject. Example, is a beautiful day. This fragment needs a subject, such as, it. 2. Missing verb fragments. These lack a verb. Example, the cat on the mat. This fragment needs a verb, such as, sits. 3. Incomplete idea fragments. These have both a subject and a verb but don't express a complete thought. Example, because she was tired. This fragment is a dependent clause that needs an independent clause to complete it. Practice tip. Try to identify whether a sentence has a subject, a verb, and expresses a complete idea to avoid these common fragment errors. Now that we know how to identify sentence fragments, how do we correct them? Let's look at some examples. 1. Adding a subject, is a beautiful day, can be corrected by adding a subject, it is a beautiful day. 2. Adding a verb, the cat on the mat, can be corrected by adding a verb, the cat sits on the mat. 3. Completing the idea, because she was tired can be corrected by completing the idea. She went to bed early because she was tired. Remember, a complete sentence should have a subject, a verb, and express a complete thought. That's all for today, learners. We've uncovered the mysteries of sentence fragments, learned how to identify them, and discovered the best ways to correct them. Keep practicing and soon enough, you'll master the art of crafting complete, grammatically correct sentences. Until next time, happy learning!